For when you have to spend half an hour working on the tools that, that are supposed to help you do your job, yeah. All right. <laughs> I'll be back. Okay, so I'm going to do this video on the Navi Plus 3000. Eh, let me just double check what that is. Navi Plus Pro 3000S. Uh, I ran into a problem when I was working on an iPhone uh, last week. And it seems to be a common problem, but it's not something I anybody's done a video about. Um, I know I did. The first thing I looked for was a video on, on the problem. So I powered this thing up. And I was getting no touch on the screen. So I couldn't, it had been sitting in a drawer for about a year. But yeah, I pulled it out. I was getting no touch on the screen. After a while, getting frustrated with it, I opened it up. Uh, it turns out these cables right here tend to get loose and become a little jarred. They're, they're kind of like the Samsung tablets. You know, a lot of times it's, it's about resetting the cables. Well, in this case, it's about resetting the cable. Apparently, uh, a lot of times when it won't boot up, this is a solution as well. Uh, so I ended up resetting this cable, and I ended up resetting this cable because it's easier to put this cable back in by removing this board. So anyway, just a little short video. If you're running into problems on the Navi Plus, you know, open it up, reset your cables. It will probably solve your problem. All right, thanks for watching.